Planes, Games with Jay. All right, let's uh, let's go back to old Red Hot uh, and uh, toot my little horn. Toot my little horn. Move my little shart. Shart apart. Did you play Fire Emblem Warriors? I did. I loved Fire Emblem Warriors. Yeah? Uh, but you didn't? I did not. Uh, if you like Musou games, it's quite fun. I, um, maybe I should pick it up. Yeah. Um, I, I, I remember when they first announced the roster. Wait, do you have a teleporter ring? Right? I think you can use that. I don't care. You're going to walk all the way back? I want, we maybe even miss some items. Like oh. this one. You know, if we hadn't gone through this dungeon, we would have missed on the def out the defense robes. The defense against the dark arts robe? Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, uh, I, when I first saw the roster, I was a little disappointed. I was like, wow, I thought Tharja would be a shoe in because, like, a ma like I think there should be a, a you know, long range character, like a magic character or something, mm, right? Yeah. I think Tharja eventually became a DLC. It was a DLC. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, maybe I should pick it up. I don't know. Yeah, yeah that's fun. Um, there's also the, the new one is coming. Yeah, uh, yeah. I don't know how interested you are in that one, but uh, I'm, oh, I'm very excited for that one. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, I, I feel like I should finish three houses. For... You didn't finish three houses at all. I finished Golden Deer route. Ah, and that's I'm like almost done with Blue Lions, and then I was gonna do Black. Or do you think? Okay, do you think I should do Ashen Wolves before finishing Black Eagles or? Ashen Wolves, you mean the DLC? Yeah. Uh, I would say. So you, so you haven't finished your. You've, you've played Golden Deer, and what are you doing right now? Blue Lions? Yeah, I'm almost done with Blue Lions. And you're asking me, should you finish do Ash Wolves before doing it? The, before Black Eagle. That doesn't really matter. Like, okay. I would I would say, are you going to play Black... Are you going to do all three? Yeah, eventually. Are you going to do, do all four? What's four? What's the fourth The one? Silver Snow, which is like... Oh, it's very similar to Blue Lions. It's basically like... Hey, you do Black Eagles, but you do something oh, different. Oh, you, you choose the well, church. Well, choose... <laughs> okay, whatever. Yeah, anyway. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. Okay. <laughs> um, and so... Um, uh, I don't know, because that ending doesn't sound very... In or that path just doesn't sound very interesting to me, mm -hmm. but... Um, I say, like, I saved... I'm saving Black Eagles for last because of reasons, but... Um, mm, I see. But, uh... But, yeah. I, um... I think doing all three at least is worth. I did all. I mean, I did a lot. I did like uh -huh. seven times, but um, yeah, I would say it's worth doing. But uh, if you don't, um, I wouldn't say it's the end of the world to just move on to the other one. Cause okay, uh, but yeah, Warriors is great, and you, uh, you never played like Hyrule Warriors, right? No, that one's fantastic. Um. Both of them have really, really fun sort of like these sort of one player. Well, it's all, I mean, one player, I guess, but um, where you like unlock parts of a map, like doing missions and stuff. It's really addicting. So, mm. um, yeah, I, I highly recommend both games. Oh, I really lucked out last time, huh? I mean, right now, I'm actually just kind of looking for items, but... Uh... I, uh, definitely found the path very quickly. Oh, I'm, I'm at level 5? Mm, let's do a little pancake. If you had a food-based move, what would you pick for your food? Popcorn. Oh, yeah, that's right. You and your burnt popcorn. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Have we had that discussion on here? I don't think so. Oh, okay. Y yeah, uh, well, you and Dave love burnt popcorn. Not, and it's not, like, completely burnt. We're, like, we like it when there's, like, a variation of, like, oh, this is, like, you know, a normally cooked popcorn, and there's, like, a tiny bit of, like, slightly burnt parts to it, you know? Mm. I, t I don't know. It's like, uh, I just, I, I guess I'd have to see. If, like, are we talking like black? No, not pure black. But you know how like sometimes the inside of the popcorn is like almost black? Like, Does it taste charred? Yes. I hate that. Oh, I hate that. Mm. Oh, it's disgusting. Disgusting. 
It's like burnt hair. It's disgusting. Burnt hair. Yeah. Enjoy your burnt hair kernels. I'm I'm good. How is this one still alive? I have no clue. Do you have any other um food things that you're like, mm, maybe not like a typical uh like what people like sort of thing? Um Hmm. Any controversial food opinions. Controversial food opinions. I don't think so. Yeah. I guess it's the, like, you know, the fish stuff. Right. Bones, chicken bones, yada yada. So. Wait, chicken bones? You know, the. I, I mean, like, I can eat bones, like chicken wings and yada, but I'd rather have, like, boneless. Oh, okay. Yeah. So. I like bones, but the convenience of boneless can be nice sometimes if you're like, I don't want to, especially like one d detractor for me and like wings and ribs sometimes is like, I don't want to get messy, you know? Yeah, yeah. So it's like boneless can be nice. You can just eat them nice and neatly. Totally. Uh, um, it's like whenever I, okay, so there's like nothing, there's like yeah, diddly dick in this dungeon. I think you should. Nope. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm telling you, I don't want to miss out. I can't believe that goes all the way to a dead end, though. Okay, because I'm pretty sure I, I remember the way. It's like this. Yeah, see? Okay. I knew where I was the whole time. So back to Red Hot. Who do we talk to? Guanji? Oh, never mind. I guess. It's so quiet here. Something's not right, don't you think? <laughs> ah! Did you hear that? How, how could I not? <laughs> That's a dragon's cry. Let's go check it out. One left to kill. Uh, probably maybe in the shack. <laughs> nope. Nope. It ate Guanji. Uh, in here. Was there anyone that was like, hey, we're gonna hide a dragon? Wow, <laughs> they just ate everybody. I didn't mean to leave. Could be on the bridge again, but let's just... Maybe, maybe Guanji's family knows. <laughs> Where's your stupid dad? Oh, that's really... Okay, I'm reading the guide that's really dumb. <laughs> do you know, do you know, is it something I would you, not be able to figure out? You have to go back to Salsa Volcano. <laughs> What? Yeah. Why? Yeah, that's it. And that, all that to go back to Red Hot was just to hear the dragon cry. Okay. <laughs> um. This, this guide is suggesting go north. In the case this time or something. Um, I don't need a guide. Okay. Fine. Put it down. I am putting it down. <laughs> what are you gonna rush for? Not in a rush, I'm just trying to be helpful. Well, stop. Stop. <laughs> Giga Storm! Listen, it's all. Yeah, they're still alive. <laughs> it's all leveling up. He's like embarrassed. Like, uh, never mind! Yeah, it's birds like Giga Storm, these nuts. <laughs> oh, holy, holy. Bye bye. <laughs> um, you said north, you little narc? Okay. North, 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 north. Hmm. I hope this is going the right direction. Mm, I think you're full of shit! I think your guy's full of shit! Okay. Well. You know, diddly dick! <laughs> Alright, you are cornet. Uh, you have to play a song on your horn every time to do the horn thing. What song is it? Mm, Daytona. What's Daytona? You know, like the racing car game? I don't know this song. Daytona. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay. What is this? It's a racing arcade game, and it's oh. like a, they would blast that theme all the time. <laughs> Interesting. 
Do they have it like round one or something? Or? Nah, I don't. They right, definitely would you find exist. It like bowling alleys or something. Bowling alleys, probably like retro barcades and stuff like mm -hmm. that. You know. Okay. I shit. I this way, right? Mm -hmm. uh, You know, I don't need a guide, because my perfect sense of direction led me there Get the fuck down the <laughs> stairs! Uh, my perfect sense of direction led yeah. me there last time. I don't need your diddly dicky Oh, but that, that's the- th oh, I was pointing out that there's apparently something somewhere else you need to go. I don't know. The guide's not, like, super- Yeah, super. you know what? We'll just figure it out how we play the game naturally. You okay. ever thought about that? Of course. You ever thought that you speedrunner fuck? Daytona! How does it go? <laughs> <laughs> How does it go? Daytona, nah. Daytona, like that. <laughs> find it, find it on YouTube. Oh, you want me to find it? I want, I want to listen to. That's gonna okay. be our uh, cornet theme. They haven't leveled up in a while. All right, Elkin, failure. Is it this one? <laughs> oh. This song fucks. What right. the fuck? Right? Daytona! <laughs> Holy shit. What? You've never played one of these games. No. Uh, <laughs> it's just uh, a, it's a simple racing game. I actually don't play a lot of those racing ones, so I'm, I'm not super familiar. <laughs> Daytona! Holy shit. Okay, well, that's what I'm going to sing every time. Your neighbors are going to love it. Uh, all right. So I think I know the way to the volcano. Mm -hmm. I know, apparently I'm not supposed to go to the volcano, but I'm gonna try to find that way anyway and play the game naturally. Mm hmm Naturally. Okay. Daytona! <laughs> uh, that's the name of the episode. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. What's an arcade game that you don't see as much around as much anymore, but you miss? Hmm, an arcade game I don't see as much anymore. For me, um, it's another racing game called uh, Arctic Thunder. What's Ar that? Arctic Thunder is a racing, uh, like, uh, snow ski game. And the, you literally ride on a snow ski, and when you're playing, they had air vents, so they just blasted air at you. Mm -hmm. to show that, you know, make so you feel it feels like, like you're going down the hill? Yeah, going That's down the cool. hill. Yeah. And it was like, you know, it's kind of like Mario Kart. There's different items you can run into and get. Um... Why is it? Ooh, come on. Don't do this. Why is it stuck here? I guess we'll find out. Anyway, can <laughs> maybe maybe what's what the hell is her name? Uh, Coco Chan or something? It's like I don't know. Oh okay. wow, that was yeah, that weird. Was a little bit the process. Okay. Kokoro Chan had to um, think for a second. But yeah, and so there was items you can get, but also there was a melee button. So whenever you're near someone, like your character would, you know, be like on a jet ski. But like for example, if you let's say do melee right, like left or right, they would straight up try to like, like, like stand at, like a little bit off their, of their of their snow ski and try and punch or kick the person next to them. Damn. It was so visceral. I. Loved it, um, but yeah, Arctic Thunder. I'm sure it's still around. I know there's a similar water version called Hydro Thunder, but it didn't do the same justice to me. Um, one I'll say, uh, I don't think it's rare, or maybe it is. Maybe it is. I don't know. I I haven't seen it like everywhere. Mm -hmm. Have you played the the Luigi's Mansion arcade game? Yeah, once. Yes. Yeah. Yes. That one was really fun, where you have the the vacuums yeah. and. Uh, I think it's at the Santa Monica Pier. That's where I played it. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I played it. Actually, I think I might have played it in L.A., but I don't remember where. Mm -hmm. Could be the same place you were saying. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't. I don't think I played at the pier. I think I. It was some. I think it was a Dave and Buster's oh. so in some mall somewhere. Okay. Because me and Elvis. Elvis, if you're watching this, you'll you might remember where that was. Uh, okay, so I'm back here, but apparently. Oh, uh, you're full of shit. Thank. You. Thank you for motivating us. I can safely say the crisis is over. In return, I will give you the stone the dragon was carrying. Are they, like, desecrating the dragon corpse? Uh... We finally did it! We will have peace again! Are we the baddies? It was my blow that struck it down. I'll be a hero. Whoa. Guardian! <laughs> it was the harbinger of disaster! It deserved no... This is fucked up. Whoa. <laughs> 
Mayor, we'll bring the egg back to the village and destroy it. We don't want any more dragons. I hope they all get eaten, these sick fucks. It's the curse of the dragon! Let's get out of here! Oh, man. Holy shit. What was that? Do you know, are you familiar with that anime, Shiki? Shiki. Sounds familiar. It's like a vampire one. Um, uh, I don't think I saw it. I never saw it, but I watched the video essay about it, because I was like, I don't know if I'll watch this, but I just mm. watched the essay. Is this recent? Recent years, but not like... I, I Maybe 2010s, but not like, you know, mm -hmm. right here. But like, it was like this weird like thing of... Um, um, similar to this where the first half of the show is about you know different all these different vampire characters and like they're like oh, going into the hey, village Tona. <laughs> and like you know abducting people yada yada and we see like their inner relations as vampires right mm. you know and why they must survive and then the second half of the show is like the townspeople are tired and they're fighting back and they basically are like hunting down all the characters we spend times with and like torturing them to death like really relentlessly like it's weird i'm like what yeah it's so like all the are the vampires supposed to be bad guys i guess they're bad because they're vampires but like we do feel for them because like there's like vampire couples there's like vampire like families and then the show just ends with them all getting murdered i don't know if all of them are murdered but there's a big portion of like people getting like tortured to death <laughs> or vampires getting tortured to death wow <laughs> anyway we got a dragon's egg i've been expecting <laughs> you it looks as if you found the firestone now give it to me there's no time for this. <laughs> Come on, stop. Stop it. There's a volcano. All right, time to fight Crodia. Oh, oh. Why does she have... Uh, horn. Horn it up. Get that pancake. <laughs> you want to do the reward? No, no, no. Like, get to level five and then... Daytona! This might... Okay, at least level four. Okay. Level four is what we, all we need for it. Oh, then. Yeah, fuck them. Fuck them up. Daytona! Get fucked, Crodia! Okay, shart. Let's do a little holy. Holy crap. Did we remember when Etoile just like had a gat and just shot us? Yeah, I missed that. <laughs> Why can't we get her as a party member? <laughs> and fuck! Okay, Tara, you actually get to have a turn. Um, let's do... <gasps> Mega Meteorite, Meteor, Mega Sleep, we'll do Meteor. Yeah, Meteor hurts everybody, I think, right? Yeah, get fucked. Damn. Okay. Natona! Pancake, bitch! Eat up! Don't be a dork! Okay. Wow. Okay. It's just a level up game. Yeah. What should we do, Kururu? That's its name. Okay. okay. The lava surrounding us. I don't know about you, Cornet, but I can fly, so... <laughs> <laughs> See ya. Quickly, hold on to me. <laughs> Kuru's like, thanks for the pancakes. <laughs> it was really delicious. Kuru's like, I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. It was nice knowing you. Why? Why did you save me? Because you have some unfinished business. Look behind you. Live and pay for your crimes against nature. I'll let you keep the Firestone to remind you of your shame. What? My shame? Until we meet again. Oh yeah, I'm so ashamed. Cool. Uh. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> hey, Cornet, let's finish the job. <laughs> I think it's our responsibility to raise that baby dragon. Uh, let's, no, leave it behind. Kiwi! 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 Oh, Flare, Flare. turned into a puppet? What? It's a little disconcerting. <laughs> this, is, this, is, <laughs> this is fucking weird. Yeah, that's a little... Um, um, Flare's level see. one? I feel like it's one of those that's like, hey, it'll like... You know... It'll pay off later. Kind of deal. Uh, but I like Tara. Right. Okay. Maybe you should save. No. Okay. Fuck that. We need to go in six levels. All right. Uh. We have the Firestone. 
This is back to Red Hot, or? I guess we'll check Red Hot. To let, to tell the let people, tell the people that, hey, you guys are bastards. We're gonna grow this dragon to get revenge on you. Uh, one day it'll be back, and you will all, you will all pay. <laughs> uh, okay. Maybe the bridge. Nope. Hmm. We did everything. I mean, we could go to what, the Tower of Wisdom and ask him what to do, maybe? I'm gonna try that first. Excuse me, wizard! Oh. Do you oh. want me to tell you? Fine! Red you Hot. What?! <laughs> we, went, we went across the continent! Okay, we gotta go all the way back. House on the left. Here, let me just get stuck. Oh. <laughs> what? Oh, why did my grandpa have to die? He taught me everything. He even taught me how to operate the bridge. Would you like to know? Because I don't give a shit. Okay, first turn on the second and six switches from the top. You'll hear a sound when you've done it correctly. After that, turn off the second and sixth switches. Put the first. Oh boy, second and sixth, and first, fifth, and sixth. Got it. Mm -hmm. Second and sixth. Flip yeah. them down. First, fifth, and sixth. Mm -hmm. Okay. What bridge? Suspension bridge. What? We already went across this. Remember how there's multiple? Pa Remember you were like, oh, that's up. That one path that you tried to go on. Why do we enter this way every time? <laughs> okay. Set is, is this the second? No, so, no apparently number the first switch is on top. So That's stupid. Okay, second. And six. Then turn them back. Then turn them off. Then first, fifth, and sixth, right? Mm hmm. Cling! The suspension bridge is down! Wow! It's about time! Jesus Christ! Ah, well, there you go. This one's blue, so it's different. Yep. All right, I'm gonna get to the boss in one shot. Yeah. That's that's just a little break, a little detour. Of course. Um, that's part of the. This again. This is all part of how you get there. You know, it's. Yeah. If you don't go to those areas, I'm pretty sure the path doesn't open up. So. Um, Ew, uh, I do not like these walls. What are wrong with them? I don't know. Their anatomy is not correct. <laughs> I, and what should a big fantasy werewolf monster's anatomy be? I don't know. Hmm. You know, the one thing about Elkun is his MP is kind of low, so I'm like, well, yeah. maybe. Is it maybe there's like MP increasing items give it to him? Maybe. Or is like is that where, you know? I'm curious about Flare. What do you want to switch out? Probably Elkin. The oh. other ones are pretty good. Try it. El yeah, Flare. I feel like he'll become like a powerful dragon or something. <laughs> powerful dragon. Powerful dragon. You know? Uh, oh wait, that was that was the door, huh? That's so hard to see. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, the color of these caves remind me of um, the Cave of Wonders in Agrabah. In, um... <laughs> yeah. Okay. Daytona. Uh. Okay. 
shard a shard apart. Actually, what am I doing? Move. Yeah. In uh, every Fire Emblem game you play now, do you make sure you get all the characters now? Oh yeah. Okay. For sure. I mean, but that's the thing. Like in Three Houses, there wasn't any recruitable people, right? Like. Well, you could get other peoples from other houses. Oh well, I guess that's the way to do it. Yeah. Like I just meant like on the field. Right. Yeah. Right. Wind heal. You better get a good offensive spell, buddy, or I'm switching you, putting you right back in the bench. <laughs> I don't need no healing shit. I heal every three seconds when leveling up. Uh, Daytona. I wonder if we, if there's like a third shark sister. Shark, Terra. Shark, Terra, Saurus, Rex. Source Rex, I think it's the next <laughs> Okay, of course. Yeah. Meteor is the one that hits multiple. Yeah. This dragon has until the end of this dungeon to get a good spell. I'm gonna throw it down the stairs. Is there not like a run button? Yeah, you're running. So. Yeah, but it's using the joystick and it's super fidgety. Okay. <laughs> Illustration 12. Let's look at it. Who do you think it's going to be? I have no clue. Who the f... It's cute. Is that her? Yeah. That's how small she is? I guess. <laughs> Why is she so fucking big here? <laughs> She's like a fucking beautifly. Like an alpha beautifly. <laughs> a big ass piece of shit. I think I saw you tweet a while ago, like, why are all these wormples so big? What was that about? Just like an uh, Arceus? Because uh, I think I needed like a light one. Oh, yeah. D dude, are those tasks annoying? Yeah, I was like, why are these wormples such big pieces of shit? Like, where are the small ones? It's the worst where I'm like, you look small. You gotta be small. And you catch it and it's not. Yeah. Oh, man. Ooh, excuse me. Dungeon designs have never gotten better than this. Oh, boy. Okay. See? I'm a master. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> you, <laughs> you left. Yeah, okay. Oh, well, you found white snow. Oh, the snowman! We gotta kill the snowman! Well, maybe... Oh, this is White Snow, a town filled with snow. I just need to make sure you guys heard that, because it's really important for the next episode, so... Yeah. Uh, it's really crucial lore. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Bye.